Well hi everybody, how are you getting on in this lockdown? It's a bit like the Second World War isn't it, you know, all that pulling together and you know, the fighting the enemy and like the Dunkirk spirit. And um, a few people have asked us, would we do some forest songs in this lockdown just to keep you entertained? So I'm going to do one now um, and it's about Jen's Uncle Harry. Now, Uncle Harry uh, Harry Williams was his name. Um, he used to come from Lidbrook. Um, he's been dead about 20 odd years now. Uh, but he was a Dunkirk veteran. And I would meet him pretty well most Sundays for a while and take him down to Lidbrook British Legion where he'd sit there supping points of cider with his chums and yarding as, as uh, the old foresters used to. And uh, one day I said to him, Harry, what was it like at Dunkirk? What, what was it really like? And he said to me, well, do you really want to know? I said, yeah, I'd love to know. I'd love to know what, how did it feel like for a bloke to go through that? And so this is the story that he told me. When I first rode out of Lidbrook town upon the train of war, I'd soldiered down in India, Rangoon and Singapore. I said goodbye to kith and kin and loaded up me gun off to the fields of Europe to fight the spiteful Hun. Well, we travelled into Belgium and tried to make a stand against that mighty blitzkrieg that was cheering up the land. Machine gun bullets killed my pals and other men just cried. Is this what we've been training for or was it all just lies. Now Daddy Long, the Sergeant Major, had been here before. He'd fought those sauerkraut yutters in that first great bloody war. He led us down the canal pass from St. Quinton town to the channel port of Dunkirk as the sun was going down. Well we found a bombed out nappy store and just a pair of legs. We got inside that building and we stole a load of fags. We took them to the beach that day as Stukas made their run and swapped them with some Geordies for a load of stolen rum. Well, we laid there in that bedlam of bullets, muck and mire and we all got drunk as monkeys underneath the enemy fire. I woke up with a hangover and thought, go bugger me. Cause I woke up in England, I crossed the raging sea. Well, I went back home to Lipbrook and this story I could tell. Just a simple soldier living through this bloody hell. I even got a medal just for being on that sand. A tiny grain of history, just a Dunkirk man.